We've been working with Council Member Gil Cedillo for, for a few months now, and we were able to get funding to assist the street vendors, uh, specifically to the Westlake Pico Union street vendors with financial assistance. Street vendors, like any other business, uh, they're, they're hurting right now. So like uh, a lot of people don't want to go out. So many of them haven't been able to keep up and, and it's been really difficult for them. It depends on the family size, how much pe uh, families can get. The funding is not for their business, but for their personal expenses. So for example, if they're behind on rent, behind on their bills, or they need money for personal care, our case managers will be able to assist them with funding for that. If they need uh, clothing or household goods, what we do is we buy a gift card, our case managers go with the customer to spend the money. Funds are anywhere from $700 to $1,500, depending on the family size. Pues de pagar los biles del internet para los niños porque lo ocupamos para la escuela, de la luz, debemos luz, debemos la renta y eso que nos va a ayudar bastante. Más o menos, ¿cuánto estaba ganando y cuánto es lo que ha perdido? No, es bastante la diferencia. Anteriormente sí hay mucha gente trabajando, la gente trabajando compra. Pero ahorita el tiempo que está, mucha gente no trabaja, no compra, entonces la venta ha bajado bastante. Y cuesta un poquito para conseguir el dinero, para pagar los biles, pagar la renta y todo. Es una suma ayuda bastante que nos dieron ahorita. Council member wanted to make sure that street vendors here in this area would receive some sort of financial assistance and also technical assistance on how they can get their documentation in order so they can in the future uh, be eligible for some other like programs in state and federal.